Welcome to Good Energy. We report on tennis. Good Energy reporting on tennis. The round of 64, that's where the upsets happen, guys. Look, I've, I I cover tennis. I know the round of 64 is a dangerous round, guys. Uh, but nonetheless, the big stories on the day. Paula Badosa eliminated, guys. I don't necessarily call that an upset. Uh, Petra Martic has great stamina. She's the queen of redirecting. She'll take the pace off of any of your shots. Um... Other news stories on the day, aside from Paula Badosa being out, that's probably the biggest uh, elimination. But Victoria Azarenka, Marta Kasu, Marta refuses to shake hands. Look, we're not going to get too much into that kind of drama. But the reality here is uh, Victoria Azarenka is a good person. And most people are good. Most people are good people in the world, no matter, you know, the 5% of the bad that's shown does not take away for the 95% of the good that most people are. And if you know the history of Belarus and, and Russia, then then you know. Come on, guys. But the reality here is um, another Lauren Davis upsets Katarina Alexandrova. Little Lauren is through. That's exciting to see Lauren. Look, I picked Lauren to uh, upset Bronzetti in the first round. Any word on Bronzetti? Any Italian fans, let me know. What's the word on Bronzetti? But look, I said Lauren needs to get it together. She's getting older. She's got to make a run. Good job, Lauren Davis. That's great. Elisa Cornet takes the first set from Sinekova. Belinda Bensick comes back from a three-set thriller. Uh, Iga Swiatek, Sloan Stevens played a great first set but couldn't keep up with the pace. If you guys watched the match, you heard Sloan's coach just blasting Iga. She can't play longer than six shots. Keep the rallies long. Look, I've been saying that for a long time now. It's good to see the coaches uh, put an emphasis on the strategic things that I say, and uh, especially in my preview and prediction videos. I might be back for the round of 32, but you can donate to the PayPal. I'll send you a personal link. Uh, perfect on personal picks today, guys. I had this match here. Kim Win Zong. First set going over. That was a lock, ladies and gentlemen. I had Yu Yan over um, over Big Yu. First set money line. Unbelievable. I took Sharana Sersteya. First set money line underdog over Bensik. So perfect on my picks. Just uh, look, donate to the PayPal. Uh, I get your email. I'll send you a, uh, a free lock. So thanks for all the support. But the big story, Paula Badosa's out. Listen, a lot of people are talking about the seeding in uh, the U.S. Open. Look, the seeding, Serena Williams, Annette Conteve, in my opinion, I love Annette Conteve. I do not want her fans attacking me. I went through a lot with her fans. She's got a, she's got a good following, but definitely not bigger than Queen Serena. Queen Serena, the matchup with Annette Conteve, very favorable. I think Annette's the weakest out of all the top 10 players. Look, she had that great indoor win streak last year, 23-plus matches. Great, but she's not playing good. She hasn't played good this year at all. She's lost several questionable matches. She, I've Look, locks. I gave you the lock on Shui Zong Shui to defeat uh, Annette Conteve, plus 300. I gave you the lock on Jill Teichman to defeat her and Lee in Miami. Um well, that was that was an upset, Ann Lee in Miami. She should have beat Ann Lee, the reality. But Annette hasn't been playing good this year. And look, Isla Tomjanovic, she plays much similar to Annette Conteve. The floodgates are opening. If Serena gets past Isla, and Isla's having the best year of her career, so that's not going to be an easy match. But a prime fit Serena, that, that match is a joke. Let's be honest, a prime fit Serena. None of these ladies have the skills or IQ to compete with Serena. But nonetheless, let's say she gets past uh, Isla. Serena is the favorite, by the way. I haven't seen that in a while. Well, actually, the first round, she was a 4-1 to favorite. But um, Samsonova, that could be dangerous. But again, a prime fit Serena, Samsonova is just not a threat. She doesn't have the shot variety. But nonetheless, guys, the story of the day, Paula Badosa eliminated. I'll do a video on Serena's matchup. Actually, I'll do that shortly. I'll do that next. Uh, but Ken Wins on goes two tie breaks. And look, Ken Win. I don't. I don't think she, realistically she can win the U.S. Open uh, because as it, the draw gets, if she gets deeper, deeper in the draw, she can't. Her return game is not good. She can hold serve, but she goes too many tie breaks. She can't put opponents away. And Estasia Potapova, better clay player, but you know, you go two tie breaks with her, it's just not. Uh, you know, I don't have Kenwin winning the U.S. Open, but nonetheless, she's in the round of 32. Enjoy the game checks. She drove all around Europe during the shutdown to play tennis. She's a great young talent. She's 19. Good energy reporting. Stay tuned.